ओके गाइस आई एम मेकिंग दिस वीडियो अबाउट द न्यू मोटो ऐप फॉर द मोटो जी फोर प्लस आफ्टर द अपडेट एंड राइट ऑफ द बैट यू कैन सी दैट द आइकॉन इट सेल्फ हैज चेंज एंड वी सी दैट देर आर टू कैटेगरीज वन इज द मोटो एक्शन एंड द अदर इज द मोटो डिस्प्ले इन मोटो एक्शन यू विल फाइंड अ नंबर ऑफ जेस्टर्स और शॉर्टकट्स समर न्यू एंड समर ओल्ड द न्यू वंस आर द मीडिया कंट्रोल्स screenshot editor three finger screenshot swipe to shrink screen pick up to stop ringing and flip for do not disturb okay so swipe for shrink screen is not new but the gesture has been changed and the chop twice for flashlight and twist for quick capture gestures were present before and in the moto display section we have the attentive display which is new and we have the moto display which was present before so now i'll be going through each and one of them in details so the media control is basically where you press and hold your volume up and down keys to go to the next and previous tracks when you are listening to music from your playlist if you just press the volume up and down keys it will just increase and decrease your volume obviously now i'll be talking about the three finger screenshot where you have to touch and hold with three fingers on the screen simultaneously to take a screenshot also this is the screenshot editor where this feature is particularly useful so this one is used to take a long screenshot where you can take continuous screenshot so you just tap this icon and the device will start capturing everything on the screen you can stop whenever you want so basically you can take a long screenshot so it captures everything on the screen then there is a talk twice for flashlight we have to do this action to switch on the flash Then there is a twist for quick capture where you have to twist your wrist to quickly open the camera. Then there is a swipe to shrink screen where the gesture has been changed after the update. The swipe down to shrink screen gesture is now swipe down to the left or right corner from the middle. It should swipe up from the nav bar as well before the update. Then there is a pick up to stop ringing, where basically the phone stops ringing and starts to vibrate when you pick up the phone. And then there is a flip for do not disturb, where you can silence all incoming notifications and calls just by flipping your device upside down. Now coming to Moto Display, there are two features, one of which is new, and that is the attentive display. which basically prevents the display from turning off when you are looking at it so after the screen timeout is over if the device finds that you are looking at the screen it will prevent the display from turning off which is a really useful feature if you are reading and then there is a moto display which has been there before the update which shows a glimpse of the time and all the notifications you have for a moment when you pick up the device Do let me know in the comment section below which are the ones you use and which are the ones you keep it off. And do leave a like on this video if you guys like the video. And do subscribe to my channel for more tech videos.